Rossi, are you chompity chomping at that Bridgerton bit? Oh, I'm chompity chomp chomp chomping. First up, we have got some fresh Kim Kanye, Pete Davidson news. Okay. The blog, yeah, fresh. They the love this. 2022 fresh. thing you didn't know you needed the blog. She knows reports that Kanye's got a song out. It's brand new with some fighting words for Pete Davidson, but allegedly Pete finds it hilarious. The lyrics are, God save me from that crash so I can beat Pete Davidson's you know what. <laughs> what problems with crash? That didn't say you know what. <laughs> exactly, finesse. Allegedly, Pete never wants to feud with Kanye because that's the dad of Kim's kids. Plus, he expected to be referenced in one of his songs sooner or later. Discuss. Oh, oh God. my God. <laughs> right? Are you into this? I, I absolutely love it. We knew Kanye was going to do this. <laughs> yeah. I mean, did we expect less? No. No, and I think Pete absolutely loves it. He's happy about it. The thing is, I think he's a little afraid. Just a little bit. Pete? Yes, Pete's a little afraid. Really? Yes, it's, but he's not afraid of Kanye. He's afraid of Kanye's fans. Well, first up, our story today, it's going to be wedding bells for Machine Gun Kelly and Megan Fox. Yes. But we got details on that ring. And I liked finding out what they were. People report that Machine Gun Kelly designed it himself. He also designed it with thorn tips so that if Megan tries to take it off, it hurts a little bit. Okay, well. That feels very in keeping with them. Uh, a little torture, a little mm-mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, the ring is actually two rings, one emerald for her birthstone, mm -hmm. one diamond for his, another detail I liked knowing. And then the two are attracted to each other by a magnet that snaps them together. What's this couple gonna do next, Rossi? I'm here for this. Uh, you know, I'm here for it too. I'm glad they found each other because they, they said after they got engaged, they drank each other's blood. Yeah. Was, uh -huh, cute, okay. And then... <laughs> Um, the, Which, again, I couldn't tell if they were being jokey or serious. I never know, but I'm here for all of it. Great news, Bridgerton fans. Ooh. Any Bridgerton fans oh, here? Oh, hello. And I are big Bridgerton fans, and yeah. season two, it's on its way back. Thank you. March 25th, and oh. I can't speak English, but I can do an English accent. <laughs> We've got some sneak pics. Polygon reports that this season will focus on Anthony Bridgerton's love life and a fiery connection that he develops with a real spark plug named Kate, played by Simone Ashley. Rossi, are you chompity chomping at that Bridgerton bit? Oh, I'm chompity chomp chomp chomping. Yes, I cannot wait. I mean, I'm, I almost put a corset on today just to get ready for it. I am so excited. I, the show is full of passion. It's beautiful. The sex scenes, I don't know if you've seen it but they're intense and I miss them. <laughs> yeah. All right, next, we've seen all those decorative wooden plaques with the words, live, laugh, love on them. Well, this one is so awesome, this story, because apparently the phrase has become a huge joke for Gen Z. Okay, Yahoo Life reports that live, laugh, love is being now mocked by millions of people, especially the younger ones on TikTok every day. Some in sort of this tone, like this video, do you see this, Kelly? Look, it says, live, laugh, love. Isn't that precious? You know, we don't have anything over the couch in the den. I guess I'm gonna have to get it. It's just too, it's just too perfect for a family. Live, laugh, love, so simple. <laughs> okay, so that's one approach, but they're also using it like, I just got ghosted again, live, laugh, love, or I just filed for bankruptcy, live, laugh, love. Jay, what's your take on live, laugh, love? Well, you know, I'm, I'm going to play a bit of devil's advocate here. I, I think we need a little more live, laugh, love in our life, but not, not on a plaque, not, not in your home.